It's a few minutes to 8 in the morning and Hussein Mohammed has just arrived at his office in Milimani area in Nairobi. Hussein's demeanor depicts a man who is always on the move as he climbs up the stairs at a fast pace. His office is at the topmost floor. He meticulously performs his usual morning routine of checking his email and reading the newspapers. He spends roughly 15 minutes after which he's off again. He tells me we are headed to Dandora, located in the eastern part of Nairobi, where he has several youth soccer projects. Dandora, a middle and low income settlement, rekindles fond memories of his early childhood, growing up in a similar humble environment. Most of my life I was raised by a single uh, parent, uh, my mother. I've uh, grown up in the slums of Kibera, I've grown up in Kangware. Hussein went to Riverbank and Olympic primary schools before he joined Dagoreti High School, where he completed his studies in 1994. After high school, he worked in various companies, most notably Extreme Sports, which he formed in 2001. The word extreme sports came from uh, the kind of sport we wanted to develop or we wanted to bring into, into the country, which included bungee jumping, skydiving, uh, water um, uh, rafting, um, uh, jet skiing, you know, at the coast. The viability of targeting such an affluent and niche market did not seem practical and he opted to re-strategize and focus on football instead at the grassroots levels through the Super 8 football tournament. The inaugural tournament was staged in 2004 and has progressed favorably. Dandora Youth, the winners of the fourth edition in 2006, won the 250,000 shilling prize and are still benefiting to date thanks to their own resourcefulness. We purchased computers and a photocopy machine and we also extended the office and purchasing the stationaries, which until today is the one sustaining the club. According to Hussein, monetary gain is not the only benefit of the Super 8 tournament. We've got uh, Innocent Mutiso, who graduated from uh, the Super 8 Soccer Tournament. Uh, you've got Jerry Santos, who was discovered in uh, the fourth edition of the Super 8 Soccer Tournament and now plays uh, uh, professional football in Tanzania. You've got Joanna, who was also identified uh, in Dandora. If elected, Hussein says he's certain he could replicate the success of the Super 8 Tournament on a national scale, albeit with the proper management structures.